So Matt, earlier we just had the news that you're the new captain of Bath Rugby, you must be very proud. Yeah, obviously it's a huge honour. Um, it's something that I felt passionate about. Um, and when I've spoken to Todd and the other coaches, you know, we're on the same sort of wavelength. And I guess, you know, it's, it's something that I feel that I can have a positive effect on. Um, and yeah, it's like a huge honour. Like I said, my family are really happy. My wife's over the moon. Um, and yeah, hopefully, you know, it'll be a, it'll be a positive and exciting challenge. Must be especially exciting when you've got um, sort of on the same wavelength as the coaches, and you guys have got a similar vision. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, um, I've sat down with them, had a meal with them. Um, they explained what they what they wanted to achieve, and you know, I explained my side of it, and it, it, it kind of married up, which was which was awesome to hear that we're all pulling in the same direction. Um, you know, I'm very fortunate that there's such a great bunch of boys here, um, and they're all pulling in the same way. So yeah, like I said, really looking forward to it, and um, yeah, can't wait to for the season to start. And what else about the role are you looking forward to? I guess it's coming. It's new for me as well. You know, I get to learn and develop myself, um, and that's an important thing. You know, I've been fortunate enough to you know learn off people like Stuart Hooper and, and Guy Mercer before me, and you know, two great leaders. Um, and like I said, hopefully I can learn from them, and make my own stamp on it. And like I said, it's just about it's about the team first. So hopefully we can be successful as a squad. And uh, with at a club like Bath with such incredible history, just what does it mean to you? Yeah, it's huge. I mean, you know, I, I signed here, I think what, this is my fifth year now, I signed here four or five years ago and, you know, with the ambition of, you know, pushing on and playing the high level I could and, you know, the international level wasn't to be and I just wanted to, by the end of my career, I want to be able to look back and think I've achieved something and, you know, never did I think to be captain of such a historic and, you know, proud team. It was never really on my radar and it's just the way it's fallen into, into path me, I guess. And like I said, it's something that I've not really ever thought about because I never thought it was a reality and it's still quite surreal.